Mizaka Dizaka. What are colors? Hi, guys. We just entered a dark room. We can't see anything at all. A cat is sitting here somewhere. Can we find it? Not in complete darkness. We have to turn on the lamp. In order to see, we need light. The sun shines during the day. And at night, we need lighting from lamps and lanterns. Rays of light coming from the sun or a lamp hit the object and are reflected from it, like from a mirror. Reflected rays fall into our eyes, and we see an image of an object. Some objects allow light to easily travel through them. These objects are called transparent, and we can see through them. Opaque objects block light from traveling through them. Rays of light always travel in straight lines. See what happens if light hits an opaque object in its path. We see that shadows have appeared. You can even make your own shadow theater. Because of light, we can not only see objects, but also distinguish their color. See how beautiful it is when the world is colorful? But what would happen if we could not distinguish colors? Feel the difference! It's boring without colors, isn't it? Do you know why we see different colors? Sunlight is white. But white color is actually a complex color. It is made up of all the other colors. The great physicist Isaac Newton proved it. He took a transparent prism and sent a beam of sunlight through it. Look what happened. White light actually includes rays of different colors. When they mix, we see white light. The prism separated the rays, and we saw different colors individually. The light, decomposed into separate colors, is called spectrum. The splitting of light into a spectrum is called dispersion. We observe this phenomenon in nature when we see a rainbow. Water droplets, like small prisms, also spread sunlight into a spectrum. Now we can explain why we see different colors. Let's remember, we see an object due to the fact that it reflects the light falling on it. However, sunlight is made up of rays of different colors. Objects of different colors reflect rays of their own color. For example, red objects absorb all rays except red rays, which are reflected back into our eyes. And what rays will be reflected from these objects? Due to the fact that objects of different colors reflect different parts of the spectrum, we see a beautiful, colorful world around us. <laughs>